Hey, what is going on pros and prices? Mr. Lyman HD here and welcome to another drinks review. Uh, so today we're viewing Power King and it's be on the Zero and I believe it is the original. Um, so yeah, and you're probably wondering where I am. Well, I'm on holiday and of course I went to the shop to find some energy drinks. I found some energy drinks to review and I thought, well, I've got to review them out here because obviously you can't bring drinks and stuff back in the luggage in case they explode and the rest of it. So anyways, I got this from Spa and there was actually a spa uh, around the corner and it cost 35 cents um, and interestingly I bought the full sugar one of this as well when it was 35 cents as well so interestingly there seems to be no sugar tax so you know fair enough <laughs> no sugar tax. I uh, give you guys a 4360 of the can so we have a fairly simple can design we have most of the can being silver and white uh, we have kind of all the writing on the back being in black and then on the front like I said, we've kind of got like a heartbeat monitor here for, um, well, I don't know, really, I guess, I don't know, heartbeat rhythm doesn't really go with any of the um, Power King theme or anything, but I don't know, that's just weird. <laughs> um, on the bottom, we have nothing, and on the top, everything is all standard and silver, including the pour ring. So, caffeine content is 32 milligrams per 100 mil, as it says on the front. So, on the back, of course, everything is in uh, Spanish, so we just got a guess. Uh, so like I said, caffeine content is 32, it's zero sugar, uh, vitamins are B12, niacin, B6 and panophenic acid. And where was it actually made? Uh, Switzerland. Okay, so it says Switzerland down there, so we'll find out. But um, Okay, so of course I haven't got my trusty cup with me guys, um, so I do apologise, but I've got one of the free cups they give us, that's the... That's the uh, place I'm staying, Occidental Hood as a resort. So I know it's not see-through, but we all know what the colour's gonna be, guys. So just bear with me, you know, I'm doing a review in a different country. <laughs> so yeah, this is free cut we can, we can use. Um, so like I said, guessing the colour, it's definitely gonna be the standard Apple colour, we do know that, guys. The smell and taste, well, we'll have to find out. Right, hopefully it doesn't explode over me. No clearing bottles outside, don't know if you can hear that. There we go. Yep, I mean, you can see it pouring out, guys. Trust me, it's the same yellowy colour as you'd expect. Trust me, guys. Alright, so there's quite a lot of bubbles in there, actually. So, uh, yeah, that is the standard colour. In fact, let me give you guys a different video because we are bored. So you can see there, it is the standard, standard uh, apple colour. So nothing out of the ordinary there. Uh, the smell, let me put some more in. That's all right, this cup I've got is uh, just below 250. I think it's a 300ml cup, yeah, it's a 300ml cup, so might as well pour all of it in. So the smell. Oof. Smells quite strong of cheap energy drink. Like, it, sm it smells similar to like the Euro Shopper, but just a bit stronger. It's got that kind of, like the sugar-free version, not the full sugar, the sugar-free version. It's just got that really kind of sugar-free smell sometimes you get with the cheaper drinks. Yeah, stinks. But nonetheless, guys, let's uh, let's taste some. Cop oh, me, yeah. Yeah, just just cheap stuff. Not not nice at all. Ugh. You know what though? To be fair, it does taste like full sugar. You wouldn't think that's a zero one if it was labeled different. Now, I wonder what the full sugar one tastes like, but in terms of the actual sweetness, there is actually a fair amount of sweetness there for what it is. I'm, uh, obviously, I can't I can't really tell if it's got a spa to me in it. Oh, it has actually. A spa to mayo. Yeah, I guess that's a spa to me. So, um, so it has got a spa to me in it. But uh, yes, that is, ugh, that is a cheap, cheaper, cheaper, t cheaper taste. Ugh. I mean, the boost in the Euro Shoppers definitely tastes better than that. This reminds me of like a cheap, uh, like a cheap pound stretcher kind of drink, you know, similar to kind of like Spartan, the Spartan drink, um, which was like 20p for a 500ml can. And uh, it just reminded me of that. But no, nah, that is, um, that's not a great flavour. Not a great flavour at all, as he sips more. Mm. Yeah, it's just, I said sweetness is all right, but it's just got really, really, this weird, nasty, cheap flavour to it, like the Spartans have, and the and the aftertaste ain't that great either. So, yeah, not impressed with that, guys. Um, wonder what the full sugar tastes like. We'll have to find out. 
But on that, that gets a thumbs down for me, guys. So as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all later.